Hey guys, Oblivion here, coming at you with a duel with uh, somebody here. I'm testing, I'm dueling right now with my Infernities. Now, as you guys can see, I'm not on Dueling Network like I usually am. I am on uh, Yu-Gi-Oh Pro or Death Pro, whichever one. Um, and I really am digging this uh, dueling system. Everything's automatic. You don't have to worry about ruling. You don't have to worry about anything because uh, everything's done for you. Um, it took a little bit of getting used to because, you know, I'm so used to doing it manually and I have no problem. I'm not going to stop playing Dueling Network. I'm actually going to play a lot more Dueling Network. Um, you know, I'm going to play a lot more Dueling Network than this. But if I want to go and test a deck out, you know, I'm usually going to go for this because uh, it's a little bit faster. But I will still be on Dueling Network, guys. So, uh, you know, I'll probably have this window and then a minimized uh, Dueling Network. So if you guys message me or and I take it long, it's probably because I'm on this. So, um, let me just get the duel started. So, uh, here you see, I have a really good hand. Right now, I'm going to, uh, draw into, uh, you know, I don't know why it's so slow. Uh, let me see. Oh, no, I'm looking at it through my opponent. Okay. Um, yeah, I'm trying to... Whatever. Anyways, so, uh, here, yeah. You see me here, normal summon the Dark Reffer, and it's my opponent's draw phase. And it's gonna basically do, um, you know, so this is basically, um, my opponent here is doing, well, I'm basically doing this, and, uh, you know, he goes and, uh, does the necro thing, and I'm just like, fuck, so he banishes a shitload of my cards, um, but whatever, so here he goes and attacks the Greffer, I take the 100 points of damage, and, uh, Greffer gets sent to the grave. So, uh, main phase 2, and he sets the DD Dynamite and then the Dark Bride. Okay, so, uh, my dr draw phase is here, and uh, I draw into a Tour Guide, which is a pretty good uh, top deck, really. Um, Infernities are known for their top decks. So, here I'm going to go get um, uh, this bitch's effect, and I'm going to go special summon the Necromancer, and I'm going to go for the Levier, the Sea Dragon, and I think uh, I'm going to go for the, yeah, I'm going to go for the Archfiend. I get Archfiend's effect now to go get um, Launcher. Now, uh, here I think is where I get my plays, but he's going to go in Dark Bribe and I'm going to go change the Solemn Judgment because, I, as you guys see, I don't see a Mirage the whole game, so I knew that uh, Launcher was going to be very important to me. So here I'm going to go and negate his Dark Bribe, um, so my Launcher survives. So I'm going to go activate Call the Haunted to go get Necromancer from the Grave. Um, with Necromancer's effect, if, he's, if I have no cards in hand, once per turn I could activate his effect to special summon an Infernity from my graveyard. So, I'm going to go and uh, special summon the Avenger in defense position. And here I'm going to go sync for a uh, Doom Dragon. And I'm going to activate do, uh, Launcher's effect to um, special summon my Necromancer and my Avenger. Now, with Avenger's effect, I go and I search out the barrier, you know, just uh, for precautions. So I, I go and search out the barrier. And I'm going to go and uh, set the barrier. Now, with uh, Infernities, I'm going to search out Avenger to uh, sync for another 8, which I'm going to go and sync for Void Ogre Dragon. So right here, I basically got my loop, and I feel pretty comfortable now because I already have my um, my barrier. I have ways of negating, and uh, I have back row uh, negation and uh, monster effect negation, every negation. So here, I'm going to go and attack for 300. And uh, basically, here's where my opponent says the GG. I don't think you guys could see the chat, but he says it. But he was being a good sport and uh, letting me finish and not um, quitting. So here, um, he gets one on Necroface and one on Co uh, Cosmos because he uh, um, Gold Sarked it. And uh, here he ends his turn, and basically that's the game, guys. I basically won the game. So please, guys, let me know if you guys like the Dev Pro and uh, if you guys want to see more duel videos with it. And uh, Hopefully you guys um, do enjoy it because it, it's really fun playing with it, you know, and here I'm just going for style points and uh, yeah guys, so hopefully you guys have a good one. This has been Oblivion on Dev Pro. Catch you guys later.